Hey guys, Seth and Andrea here, and we're gonna talk about some ways to improve your agility. First, we're gonna start off with getting into a good position and kind of getting your body set up to move efficiently in and out of cuts, specifically from a lateral position on these ones. So I'm gonna have Andrea get into kind of a ready position or athletic stance, and this is gonna really help you set up and move your body weight, your center of mass, so that you can move efficiently in and out of those cuts. First thing I would have her do is kind of shift her body weight from side to side, just learning to shift that body weight appropriately, having her knees out, toes straight ahead so that her weight stays within the whole foot, but that she's moving side to side, feeling the shift in her weight. So that'd be kind of the first progression to teach where that weight should go when you're cutting. The next one would be just a cut stop. So getting into a lateral cut, so I'm gonna have her go left to right here and then right to left, and then she'll come back to neutral on each cut as well. We'll go to the right, ready, cut. Left, ready, cut. Right, ready, cut. And so you could just do a single hop, kind of setting those feet, throwing those feet into the ground and having a good angle so that you're ready to come back out of that cut. You could then progress to kind of a double cut to stop. So I'm gonna have her go right, left, and then go back to neutral. Ready, go. Ready, go. And then you go to the other way. Ready, go. Go. That kind of helps us put our body weight into the right position so that we shift our weight and we're ready to cut back um, from the way that we came. One way to advance some cutting mechanics is to do a single leg bound, specifically the skater hop. So I'm gonna have Andrea do some repeated skater hops. As you get into this position, you feel more comfortable. You're able to load properly. You can start going wider and getting a little bit longer jump to create a little more force into the ground. So those are some ways that we can progress, kind of that agility, those cutting mechanics. If this type of training is something that's right for you, please stop in or visit our online um, and come talk to us about training at D1 Sioux Falls.